Clothes aren't really that important to a vacation, but you know what is? A bag full of plastic toys to take pictures of to make you feel better about your small manhood. Hey folks, welcome back to another Lego Lover 117 vlog. I'm your host as always, Lego Lover 117, and I'm about to go to bed. Right now it's almost midnight because we have a long drive ahead of us tomorrow morning. If you're getting flashbacks to the Hilton Head vlog, which should be out at this point, uh, you're not wrong. I'm taking another beach vacation, this time with Hope's family, not mine, to go to Florida. Destin, Florida to be exact, a little outside of Panama City. Actually, right in the middle there of Destin and Panama City. I'll see you all tomorrow, making this intro very short because I need I need sleep. I'm so tired. <laughs> Let me tell you about a girl I know To have a girl you take it slow with Make one wrong move and you'll be on your way out She thinks I'm nothing But I got good loving We could be something But she holds all the cards My heart's coming under siege My friend said let it be But I don't know, I don't know, I don't know How to make them see She's got burger right now you can see behind me is the sign we are about four hours away how you feeling uh low morale uh like i said just a little under four hours to go and uh we're both just trying not to kill ourselves <laughs> we're both very hungry and just thinking about these burgers and the beach. That's all that's keeping me in my room. Oh, and the beach. I'm thinking about the house. I want to see what the house looks like. Our room. Yes, our own room. Our own room. Oh, it's going to be so nice. Except somebody forgot their ring. So. I'm so upset about it. She's single throughout this. We'll have to drive six hours back. She's single throughout this whole trip. I almost did make a joke about your wig. Like, that's why I checked the wig box before I left, because I was like, I swear, if we have to turn around and drive all the way back. Yeah, because we would. We're doing pictures. For context, okay? We were at a wedding, like, a month ago, and somebody forgot their wig at the house. And the wedding was in Lexington, which is, like, 90 minutes away from where we live. So I had to drive all the way back to Louisville, pick up the wig, and drive all the way back to Lexington, and we barely made it to the wedding on time. But we both got super tipsy, and it was fine. Oh, I'll be here. Thanks. Take your wings. Oh, I don't know what you want. Obviously, I know I was always meant to use this restroom because, I mean, just look at the rug. <laughs> Ain't nobody gonna tell me why I feel so petrified. I got this love inside, I just can't tell her Say a man's gotta stand his ground, be confident and proud Fear of rejection makes my heart take shelter I've been through the downtown, and the breakdown, and the new sound But every time I turn around Alright, so we made it, finally <laughs> I'm gonna give you guys a little brief tour of our setup here So we have the game room, which uh, is a pseudo bedroom since we're not, like, adults per se, I mean, we're technically kids in the family, but we're also adults. We get our own bedroom away from all the other kids. So we get this pull-out couch here for us. Got this awesome TV. An Xbox 360 that for some reason doesn't work. I'm determined to get that to work at some point in time, because they have Call of Duty Ghosts here. <laughs> It'd be fun to play while we're here. Um, one nightstand, which I think is kind of dumb. Well, I guess it's a side table, but you could scoot the couch over a little bit and then put another side table over there. So I guess that's my side table for the time being. Come over here. There's a little sitting area with some of the couch pillows on it. Got this really nice closet here. And then it's called a game room because it's got some games. It's got shuffleboard. And uh, I don't know what this is. I think it says out of order. Do not sit or place drinks. Not operational waiting on part. Yeah, it's some kind of arcade machine. Or no, it's a 
air hockey thing, I guess, but it's not operational. Up there is a eagle nest, as they call it, and it's a, <laughs> it's a climb to get up there. Uh, I just unloaded the car, or I got done unloading the car, and I'm really tired. I'm going to go get in the pool after I'm done with this, but you got your treadmill over here so you can work out, get your gains while you're at the beach. Here's some of the view. It's quite beautiful, I do say so myself. And that's pretty much it. That's the room. It doesn't have an attached bathroom, but that's okay. The bathroom's not too far down the hallway out that door right there, which I'll show you guys the rest of the house at some point in time while we're here. promise it's not blood in the water it's just a buildup of algae and a whole bunch of other crap but I'm just saying we did see a whole bunch of frogs last night so I think God is unleashing two plagues on us if I see locusts I'm getting the hell out guy we just found. Hello! Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He's not touching him. He's got really close to the screen. Hey, bud. This is a big chunk us. I am like the... Welcome to the eagle's nest, ladies and gentlemen. This is the third and a half floor, <laughs> you'd say. Pretty big up here. I got this nice table. Down there's the pool where all the kids are playing. I tell you what, I came up here last night uh, before I went to bed. It's so peaceful up here. It's it's nice. Uh, there's a lot of frogs that come out at night uh, that hang out in that pond out there, but. It's very nice out here. It's just just the serene sound of the ocean and the, the animals around. So I'm going to be utilizing this deck a lot more. Oh, I like this 
shocked that she made that turn. We're gonna do pictures now, right? We both look like this. We look great. Look at my hair. It's yeah. perfect. It's perfect. We'll show that on the internet. It's perfect. This is my last will and testament. I leave everything to my children. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and you almost took the side of this thing off. <laughs> Your side, that's not my problem. Stop. No, don't stop. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> Watch the road, not the camera. <laughs> this thing is slow. The one last time was way faster. Like speed limit 17 miles an hour. How fast do you think this is going right now? 20 miles an hour. 20? Wow. That's not right. How do you know? Okay, jump out and let me know. <laughs> We're doing 60 miles an hour. We'll gauge it on how bad it hurts. So you duck and roll. You won't get hurt. Who are you, Maddox? Stop it! <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> I look like a toy soldier. <laughs> So I said I'd give you guys a, a little bit more of a tour of the house at some point. So that's my own Hope's room. Come over here. This is the kids' room. Bunk. Room. Cool thing about this is it's got a little porthole in it, which actually opens. <laughs> that was pretty awesome. Um, our bathroom. These doors are locked. We can't go in. Um, this is one of Hope's aunt's room. There's also this little chair here. I guess to read or something. Staircase. And then down there. Just sitting out here on the eagle's nest. <clears throat> listening to the serene sounds of nature. It's, uh, it's about one o'clock in the morning here. I'm not tired, so... I'm going to read Darth Plagueis, maybe a chapter or two of that, and uh, go to bed after that. This is going to be a flashback. So we just did photos on the beach, and I remember last year we took photos on the beach and he dropped the golf cart. Like a bat out of hell, so I figured this would be a good flashback to kind of see, like, as it was about, hey. to, as it was about to storm, and she said, "Drive." It's a year later, and number one, we're still two together, years. and oh, sorry, two years, and we're still together, and number two, um, I'm still fighting for my life. <laughs> Alright, so it's like 12.15 right now, so uh, everyone else is asleep. I'm the only one that's awake, so I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a tour of the bottom floor. This is, this is the door. This is how you come in the house. Don't tell anyone, though. You're the only ones that know. There's a laundry room over there. There's where we keep uh, various beverages, both alcoholic and non-alcoholic. 
This is the kitchen. Well, this is your dining area. Tripod. Always, you always need a tripod. I'll show you all out there here in a little bit. Talking quiet again because there's everyone else is sleeping. <laughs> um, we got the living room over here. You've got a mini bar over here, which I can turn on the lights and show you. Check that out, huh? It's pretty sweet. Who put their modellos in here? <laughs> Something I find interesting is the fact that the TV is in a little hutch over there. And Hope brought this up earlier tonight when we were watching TV down here together. Why isn't it above the fireplace? Because they wanted to put that picture of fish up there, I guess. But you would think that the TV would be over there and that little hutch thing wouldn't even need to be built. But oh well. I guess I didn't want the TV to be the center of the room. They wanted you to like hang out together as a family, I guess. Here's technically the front door, but everyone's been coming in on that door. I'm tired in case you can't tell. Here's a mirror. Hello. Here's the front porch. There's a swing. Here's a uh, an outdoor dining area but you can't really see right now but I'm not gonna open the door because that door is really hard to close I guess I'll show you all what the pool looks like we've got a grill over here you could probably hear the frogs but this is the pool I don't know if there are lights in it. I don't think so. But this is the pool. I don't know if you guys have seen this yet. We've also got an outdoor uh, fireplace that nobody has used yet. Uh, you know, stuff happens. Those fountains turn on. Um, they pour water into the pool, they like filter it through, but they turn off at a certain point at night. They're on like a timer or something. Here's where uh, our room is, those four windows up there. So I think the only place you haven't seen yet is the middle floor where a lot of the bedrooms are. Welcome to the second floor of the house. This is the west wing. <laughs> this is the biggest room in the house. It literally goes for forever. We have a, we have a giant bathroom here. Vanity and stuff on the other side. Deck. We have a deck, but I've never actually been on it. Closet over there, and then there's the actual bedroom. Something I find hilarious is that this art has its own light. I don't know why, I just find that funny. If we come over here, we have a bookshelf with a whole bunch of books that I'm never gonna read. Here's a smaller bedroom and bathroom combination. That's Pop's room, and then here's another bedroom back there. It's for another aunt and uncle to stay in. You like the palm tree? That's nice. Is this your food over here? I forgot my food, sorry. I forgot my tamale crops. Leave it. Oh, 
We're gonna go get chalupas. <laughs> How are we feeling about it? Just I mean, obviously it's not gonna go with like the shirt or anything. So. Just shut up um, you. I think I'm gonna get it. I don't know. I'm debating. I almost dropped my phone, but I did it. I'm so mad. Because why is this so expensive? Because it's huke. It's huke. Huke. Leave me alone. Hi. We just came out of Alvin's Island. We haven't done a little shopping haul yet on this vlog, so... Can I explain something? Yeah, why don't you go first and show everyone what you got. I went around to so many hats, and they wouldn't fit. They were so big, and I was like, what the heck? I'm so mad. And I almost gave up until I tried this hat, which, as you can see, it's even kind of big right now, but if you tighten it, this, pin, this is pretty perfect. And I get in the car, and I'm like, I wonder why this fit. And then I see this. If you can't read that, it says kids. That's why it fits. It's because <laughs> it's a children's hat. I keep telling you, you have a small head, and that children's hats would fit you better than adult size. Apparently, ones. you were right because that. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what you got. Is that the only thing you got? Yeah. Oh, you didn't get the zippy thing. No, I was. I wasn't trying to spend all that. Yeah. I don't blame it. So, um. I did end up getting this. This is the best design that I saw in the store. It's kind of got this plastic thing like it's kind of mis mismarketing almost because yeah, I really like how that fits. Very nice in my head. Let's and then new hats together. Did you just tell me to sh No. Oh. I was gonna say she. Oh. But you know, <laughs> so shish. Um there was this one frame there that she liked that was like twenty to twenty five dollars or something. It was this bench, and she was like, "That's adorable. I want it." So I was like, "How about this one instead? That's fifteen. So because I'm gonna get one of our pictures printed, you'll probably see it on my Facebook or Instagram. Definitely. And it's gonna go in there. Also, there'll probably be some photos of action figures using this on the beach tomorrow because it's literally tomorrow's our last day at the beach, and I haven't taken any pictures yet. I don't even want to think about how. Tomorrow I'm is. going to utilize it well. I'm gonna bring. What? Can I also show you what I got from Banana Barts? So this shirt, check the pocket, so cute, love it. And then also look at this fanny pack. It had a weed symbol on it, but and then she got rid of it. I made my mom use like a stitch ripper and get the weed symbol off because we don't, we don't do that. <laughs> Actually, she used my wallet, didn't you? I saw her yeah. whittling away at it by the pool. Yeah. <laughs> my son. I have missed you. She's mad that we're going to Walmart. He made us come. Let's see if this one's any better than the ones back home. How much How much do you want to bet it won't be? No, I think it will. I think it'll be nicer. I hope so. The decor is definitely nicer. I was telling her on the way over here that I like seeing stuff that's by like our homes and stuff. Yeah. But it's been like tropical fied. If that's a word. Like, the other day, we were driving past a Taco Bell, and it had palm trees in front of it, and I just thought that was really cool. Good news, folks. If you need a Batman Who Laughs Joker, or Green Lantern, or Wonder Woman, or a General Lando Calrissian, or just a Lando Calrissian, the Walmart in Panama City is the place to go. Why would you throw subpar candy at me? Yeah, show him to the hat? show him to the camera. Hey, little guy. Uh, he looks so scared. Him and uh, the man. What the heck? Uh oh. Why is he keep Be doing careful. that? Be careful. Because he doesn't like you. Little guy. <laughs> hey, crew. Why don't you go upstairs and get your brothers and tell them to come down? You saw him flaws in your lawn. Hey. Crew, why don't you run upstairs and tell your brothers to come down here? So they can see the frog.
So it's the last day. We're all sad. We have to go back to reality now. It's very, very sad for all of us. I don't want to. And why did it go by so fast? It always does. Like, it went by scarily fast. It was fun. I don't want it to be over. That's the issue, is that I don't want it to end. But I had a lot of fun. I didn't sit in the shade at all today. I was in the ocean for five hours. <laughs> so I'm kind of... Okay, you burned it up? No, I'm definitely a little bit tanner, but I'm not, I don't think I'm burned. So anyway. Well, that's good. Do you have anything to say about the vacation? I thought it was really fun. I had a great time. It was my first big vacation with her family. I don't really count the one. I kind of count the one last time because I was there for part of it, but I wasn't there for the whole week. Yeah. And it was, um, I feel like I'm one of you. I was yeah. Saying the other night to the it's a big bump. I was saying the other night to the camera by myself up on the eagle's nest that yeah, I feel accepted, and that's really that's really cool. And yeah. I don't want it to end because it's it's been super fun. Look, that's where we stayed last year. This is always the saddest day because it's the last one and you just don't want it to end. I have, though, good things waiting for me back home. I have an interview for a new job next week, next Friday. That won't matter by the time you're watching this, but at the time it's being recorded, I'm in the midst of interviewing for a new position for another company, and I'm Hopefully my reality shifts a little bit when I get back, because I hate my current job. It's really dumb, and I don't like it. I just want there to be a beach at home. That would be nice, wouldn't it? My job's lined up and ready. I just, I don't want to do it. I want to sit on a beach all day. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Alright gamers, it's the last day. Time to go. <laughs> the couch bed is now back to its original form of a couch. How we doing? You seem not comfortable. <laughs> Cruising down the 